In this video, I'll show you how to color correct skin in Affinity Photo. Let's get started. If you'd like to follow along with me, I've left a download link to the image that I'll be using in the video description. The best adjustment to color correct skin is the selective color adjustment. So let's get started by applying that adjustment. You can see that this adjustment has four sliders, cyan, magenta, yellow, and black. Let's dig into that a little. The cyan, magenta, and yellow sliders can be raised to add those colors to the picture. But if you move them the opposite way, something a little unexpected happens. Lowering the sliders will add different colors red, green, or blue. You may have heard of RGB colors and CMY colors. These colors are opposites of each other. So the sliders might be confusing at first, but once you know that each of the colors are paired with their opposite color, it's much easier to understand what's happening. As I lower the cyan slider, red will be added to the picture. As I lower the magenta slider, green will be added to the picture. And as I lower the yellow slider, blue will be added to the picture. Before we jump back into Affinity, one last thing to know is that all skin is made up of red and yellow. So as we work on this adjustment, we will stay in the red and yellow color channels. Okay, let's take a look at the dialog box one last time. At the top, you can see that we're currently working in the red color channel, which is perfect since skin has red in it. That means this will affect the skin as I adjust these sliders. And then we have the sliders. Even though they all look like they go from white to their respective colors, we know that there are secret RGB colors on the other side. So let's go ahead and adjust this. Right now, to me, the skin is looking a little too green and a little dull. We know that green is the opposite of magenta, so let's start by raising the magenta slider to counteract the green. We also know that skin naturally has a lot of red and yellow in it, so to make the skin less dull, we can add red and yellow. To do that, I'm going to lower the cyan slider to add red. And then I'm going to raise the yellow slider to add yellow. You can see this already is a huge improvement for our picture. Here's the before and after. We can make the skin even more vibrant if we also adjust the colors in the yellow color channel. So I'm going to click right here to change to the yellow color channel. And I'll adjust the colors in a similar way. There's still a little bit of green in the skin, so I'll start by raising the magenta slider a little. Then I'm going to lower cyan so that we can add red. And I'll also raise yellow to add yellow. By the way, I never adjust the black slider. It makes the colors lighter or darker, and I'd rather just use curves if I'm going to adjust lighting. All right, with that, we can go ahead and see the before and after. Great job! Now you know the best way to color correct skin. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next Affinity Revolution tutorial.